Hey guys, so it's time to have a look at some, you know, we you know, we need to benchmark this new GTX 590 card and compare it to some other interesting cards like the Radeon 6990 HD, also the Dual GPU card. So yeah, we have a war here. So the test system that these guys were using, uh, just so you know, was an Intel Core i7-920 overclock to 3.70 gigahertz and then also x3 2 gigabytes of g.skill ddr3 pc 12 12800 cas 99924 asus p60 deluxe intel x58 ozz i'm not sure how you say z z ozz zx series 1250 watts yeah damn that this is some you know this is a sick uh, some six specs that they used. Real as they use the SSD drive, they use Gigabyte Radeon 6970, and they use the 6990, and they use the Radeon 5970, and they also use the HD 6970, the GTX 590, G GTX 580, and the GeForce GTX 570. So the program that we are going to take a look at is obviously the Future Mark Benchmark, the 3D Mark 11, the Pro Edition. So some software that they used also was Wi Microsoft Windows 7 Ultimate 64-bit. They used NVIDIA Forceware 267.71, NVIDIA Forceware 267.24, AMD Catalyst 11.2, and AMD Catalyst 11.4 preview. Okay, that that kind of like sounds boring but let's have a look at some future 3d mark benchmarking performance in the 11 pro edition so this is at the resolution the resolution 1280 times 720 and obviously higher is better so we can see there at the top if we have crossfire the hd 697 you can see that it is better it is you know on it's in it's one of the top dogs there so that that's that's very interesting. We can see that the, then we can see that the the Radeon HD 6990, the Dual GPU card, is better. It seems to be better than the GeForce GTX 590 card, and that is very interesting because if we take a look at the GPU that they're using, use the single GPU that they're using in the HD 6990. That is basically the, the GPU that they're using is the same one that you can find in the 6970. And the GPU that the GTX 590 card is using is the same one as you can find in the GTX 580. So we could clearly see here down here that here you can see that the NVIDIA ASUS G4 GTX 580 is better than the 6970. Uh, but you know, if you go to dual here, it seems like AMD is better, and I think that could be the case because, uh, as I mentioned earlier in my part two videos, uh, Nvidia they you know they removed a lot of clock frequency. They removed 21% of the GPU when they made this dual GPU system on this GF110 GPU. So that kind of sucks that they removed it, sucks, you know, sucked a lot of life out of this GPU. So obviously you get, as I said, a lot better performance with the GTX 580 Crossfire, but who the hell buys who, you know? It is still a good card, but it seems like the, yeah, it kind of sucks, you know. But the Radeon HD AMD graphics card is better than the Dual G4 GTX 590. I know it sucks, yeah, because I love Nvidia as well. Also, you can see here on the test when they use the little high resolution 1920 times 1080, you can also clearly see that the Radeon HD 6990 it's a little better it's a little better but we should also remember that the G4 GTX 590 it's a lot cooler and it doesn't you know consume that much power it used to be a little less than the Radeon HD 6990 and it's a lot quieter so you can't really hear it so that's some pretty good advantage because it's not that you know, extremely better, but you know, use a tiny bit, and I know that the fanboys are going to hate that, but you know, you, you just have to face it. Uh, 6990, it, it is better if you are looking at some benchmark with the program Future Mark 3D Mark 11 Pro Edition. So, yeah, see you.